Hello, I'm Veronica and I'm the Residency Program Director for the Lincoln VA PGY1 Pharmacy Residency Program. The Lincoln VA is a very large community-based outpatient clinic with 12 primary care providers. Pharmacy services include an outpatient pharmacy, three ambulatory care pharmacists, telehealth services to our small community-based outpatient clinics, as well as mental health. Our program has several things that make us unique, including strong supportive preceptors, great interdisciplinary support, and the ability to have an ambulatory care focused residency, but also to have access to the Omaha and Grand Island VA campuses, which offer inpatient elective choices. Also, besides having your co-resident here in Lincoln, you would also have nine other co-residents across the three campuses, including a PGY2 resident in ambulatory care. Hi, my name is Quinn Vu. I am currently a PGY1 resident here at the Lincoln VA. My clinical interests are ambulatory care and psychiatry. The reason why that I chose Lincoln to pursue my PGY1 residency is because it offers a very strong ambulatory care setting and also a great learning environment. After only two months here, I'm very impressed with the strong support system that I'm getting from the preceptors and other providers at the Lincoln VA. I'm not hesitant to ask them any question when needed, and they provided me a very great guidance on my elective rotation as well as my future plans as a pharmacist. Besides being a strong ambulatory care setting residency program, they also offer a variety of inpatient settings for the residency such as cardio, infectious disease, internal medicine, uh, as well as inpatient psychiatry as well through collaboration from a different VAs in Nebraska. I believe that the Lincoln VA residency program would help me to become a well-rounded pharmacist in the future. Hi, my name is Chad Bartholomew and I am the Pharmacy Supervisor at the Lincoln, Nebraska VA. Thanks for taking time to learn about our PGY1 residency program. I would like to share a few things about our program as well as the management rotation. First, I'd like to point out the dedication of our RPD and preceptors uh, have to our residency program. That may seem like every residency program should have that. However, in our most recent survey done by ASHP, the site surveyor said that was one of the number one things that stood out to them the most. Uh, they definitely care about your learning as a pharmacist, uh, but also as a person. Uh, they take pride in accepting and having you be part of our pharmacy family, so to say. And I'll point out that being part of that pharmacy family is one of my favorite things of, of working in our pharmacy and also managing our pharmacy. Uh, second, I'd like to point out that 14 out of 18 past residents have gone on to work in the VA as a pharmacist upon completion of the residency. Uh, VA pharmacy jobs are highly sought after and once pharmacists start within the VA they want to they almost always want to stay within the VA. Uh, the third thing uh, in general about the residency is we are very excited to be moving to a brand new state-of-the-art clinic here for our uh, Lincoln VA and we'll be moving uh, this winter and spring and so our upcoming residents will be the first residents to be with us for the whole year. Moving on to the management rotation, uh, my number one goal for that is to expose the residents to as many management topics as possible. We will attend many meetings, either face-to-face -face or now Zoom due to COVID. Uh, we'll spend this time discussing our budget, HR topics, um, policies, SOPs, and competencies that need to be done. Uh, we'll take those discussions, put them into practice. You will help lead our monthly staff meetings, daily and weekly huddles, help gather data for our budget uh, and performance. Um, typically, there are also other projects dictated by what's going on at the time. Most recently, um, the resident on our management rotation was with me when COVID first started here in Nebraska, so they were deeply involved in adapting and changing our processes due to COVID. Again, thank you for your interest in the Lincoln, Nebraska VA Pharmacy PGY-1 
uh, residency, and we hope to see or hear from you soon. One of my favorite things about working in the VA is our veteran population. Uh, to be completely honest, when I started within the VA, I was uh, looking for residencies and looking for the best clinical opportunity and area to to learn the most as a pharmacist. Uh, personally, I did not have any family members that were veterans and and for me working at the VA uh, was just like working at any other hospital or clinic and now that I've been here almost 11 years I can say that uh, working with and helping our veteran population is, is one of the most satisfying things and um, one of the most fun things about coming to work every day. Hello, my name is Jeff Steffensmeyer. I'm a clinical pharmacist at the Lincoln VA here. I practice on a primary care team that we call PACT, which is, uh, refers to patient-aligned care team. As a pharmacist on this team, I provide medication therapy management services to patients. I provide drug information to the providers and review non-formulary and restricted formulary medication requests. As a pharmacy resident, you will work with me and other pharmacy preceptors with these types of activities. When you're here and uh, to progress you to independent practice as quickly as possible, we will provide you with uh, feedback and discussions so that you can know where you stand in your developmental skills so that you can progress as rapidly as possible to independent practice. When you're seeing patients, initially we'll be discussing the patient cases with you, and then as you're seeing patients, we will also provide opportunities to discuss the treatment plans and follow-up. As the pharmacy resident, you will document independently in the patient's chart their progress notes, you will order labs, you'll order prescriptions, as well as the follow-up appointments. Your goal during this time is to continually work towards uh, development in practicing independently and then um, our goal for your whole time here is to allow you to develop those skills so that by the end of your practice here you will be practicing independently with minimal preceptor oversight. The VA is a wonderful way to expand your clinical practice as a pharmacist. Not only do we encourage um, expanding your license and practicing at the top of our license, but we also provide care through teleservices to our rural veterans, which we've been able to successfully do um, for the past 10 years. In addition to working at our top of our practice, we also prescribe, manage, and monitor medications for our veterans across Nebraska Western Iowa healthcare services. Um, in addition, um, telepharmacy services is a virtual way to work within the medication therapy management clinical pharmacy services and allows us to provide care to all of our veterans. Good clinical skills are essential in the VA outpatient pharmacy. We have to be able to utilize current guidelines and best medical practices when reviewing non-formulary requests from providers. We also get regular phone calls from providers in clinic asking us about medication recommendations for patients they're seeing in clinic that day. We found that the knowledge and confidence to make those recommendations improve significantly during the residency year. Thank you for your interest in our program. Please visit our website for more information.